hello guys welcome to in five minutes in this presentation we are going to see the full adder so let us start with the full adder basically in full adder we have three inputs why because we have seen general two bit binary addition to which carry bit is generated okay and that whatever carry is generated which is moved to the addition of next two bits of the operation so depending on this we will fill up this table for the full adder so what we have here three inputs are there a b and c and outputs are sum and carry so let us try to fill up this but first combination since there are only two bits present we are added only two bits so let us say that two bits are a and b so for a b there are four combinations 0 0 0 1 1 0 and 1 1 so let us start with the first one where a and b are 0 0 so where a and b and 0 0 we need to add this 0 plus 0 to which it might be possible that carry generated from the previous addition of a and b so let us say that if a nth and b nth addition is taking place to which carry from the n minus 1th operation will be added to the nth operation so this carry may be present or it may not be present so let us say that the carry is not present in this case and carry is present so for a0 and b0 there are two combinations carry is present or carry is not present so this is how we fill up the next root table for the combination 0 1 once again the carry will be not present or present third combination 1 0 carry will be not present or carry will be present and the last combination that is 1 1 so carry will not be present or carry will be present so we need to add these three numbers step by step so whatever output you will get the output is a plus b plus c so 0 plus 0 0 0 plus 0 0 so sum will be 0 no carry generated and this carry is the final carry for the full adder so this c out is the final carry in the output section so now second 0 plus 0 0 0 plus 1 1 no carry generated 0 plus 1 1 1 plus 0 1 no carry generated 0 plus 1 1 1 plus 1 the total sum is 0 in this case carry is generated here 1 plus 0 1 1 plus 0 1 so sum is 1 no carry generated 1 plus 0 1 1 plus 1 0 carry generated 1 plus 1 0 carry generated and 0 plus 0 0 1 plus 1 again carry generated 1 and 0 plus 1 1 so to implement this full adder circuit we need to implement sum and carry in terms of the inputs so we need to solve the k maps for s and c 